Nice job. How about it for Lindsay Ellis? How about it for? Uh, I wore my tiara. Oh, it looks looks beautiful. Um, thank you. Um, uh, my wife didn't want to have kids, but she did want an epidural, so we were able to work things out. Uh, Steve, who's next? I'm sorry. Um, it looks like Jill Enders is our next guest. Jill Enders. Okay. It's, I, I, it says here Jill Brem Enders. Is that right? Yes. I'm sorry. You're correct. All right. So please welcome from Clayton, California, Jill Brem Enders. How about it? Yeah. It's Bream and oh my God, two minutes. Oh, that's okay. I'm used to packing a whole lot in really quickly. <laughs> Obviously. Yes, I'm used to packing a whole lot on really quickly. I want to talk to you about the elephant in the living room. I am on the ground. <laughs> I am a mess. I am an opera singer. <laughs> I've heard you should dress for the job that you want. Thank God I don't still want to be a pole dancer. You know what? I tried that job and I couldn't get my business off the ground. You know, obesity runs in my family, well, walks in my family, well, sits in my family and, and eats a lot of chips. But we do have the gene for obesity, uh, the yoga pant for obesity and worldwide pandemics, emphasis on the wide. You know, before I was COVIDly obese, I actually lost 50 pounds, and I always assumed that I would transform from a manatee into a graceful gazelle. I just became a smaller manatee. And a tiara! That's a manatee tiara! <laughs> but you know what sucks? I always had a pear-shaped body, which I've heard is healthier than an apple shape. Then menopause hit, and I became a frickin' fruit salad. But I love my fruit roll-up belly. You know what it is? It's stress. I'm a caregiver. I'm in the sandwich generation, which explains what all this stuff in my middle is. But I must be keto because I don't have any bread, dough, money. I will never retire, but I probably will expire. And I want an open casket, but I don't think I want the viewing until I've been dead for a month or two and I have time to decay enough to fit into my high school jeans or maybe a hot pair of booty shorts. My tombstone will say, go away to last. In the meantime, if I can't make less of myself, I'm gonna make the most of what I am. I'm Jill Bream, Enders, and this show ain't over till the fat lady sings. It's very clear, my lumps are here to stay. <laughs> Jill Bream enters. How about it for her? That was amazing. Um, my neighbors are pissed, but that was still amazing. That was so funny. All right. 